The RAA fears drink driving laws are being ignored following the arrest of a man who was allegedly so drunk he fell asleep at the wheel minutes after fleeing a crash. Nine News can reveal he's among 5,000 South Australian drivers being busted every year, with one in seven repeat offenders. Quarter past seven last night, a wild ride comes to an end. Police interviewing a driver who was allegedly five times over the legal limit. At that point, most people have no possible capability of controlling a vehicle safely or being responsible for their actions, so that is really serious. Earlier, it's alleged the man smashed into a Volkswagen at the intersection of Unley and Cross Roads before hitting a Toyota as he headed to Hutt Street. That's where he was found by police asleep at the wheel of his Holden Ute. Suddenly we saw about two uh, fire engines pulling up on the wrong side of the road. Next minute there was the ambulance, the police cars. The 27-year-old from Warradale will now join the ever-growing list of drivers fronting court for drink driving, many simply not getting the message. Of the 5,031 drivers convicted last year, 696 had fronted court for the same offence on at least one other occasion since 2009. Among them, two who have now been sprung six times. The, the question may be whether people are simply choosing to take the risk of not being caught again or perhaps they don't fully understand the implications of their actions. But sadly many drivers pay the ultimate penalty and end up in the back of one of these. Statistics show that around 35% of people killed on South Australian roads every year had a blood alcohol reading above 0.05. Hospital staff desperate for change. I'm disappointed at the numbers and disappointed at the number of repeat offenders. Luckily, last night's crash caused no injuries. Ben Avery, Nine News.